What's happening, fam? LAR movement still moving. Book entitled Lessons from a Non Custodial Father. Amazon Kindle Create Space. Signs that she's a keeper. I don't know if I made this video already. Now that I think about it, I don't know. Um, when you dating and you and you go out to dinner, if she's cognizant of the fact that she wants to have a conversation with you and not break the bank and ordering stuff, she's a keeper. If if you're out and She's not reckless and aloof on a date and worried about ambiance, but more concerned about you. She's a keeper. What I mean by that is, say you go out with somebody and they like, and you sit down and you order, oh, I want this and I want that and I want this, but I'm not feeling this, so I want one of these and one of these and one of these. And you're looking at her like, she doesn't, she doesn't have your best interest at heart because you wouldn't want, she wouldn't want somebody to go out when, when she was paying and they just order a bunch of shit because they feel like they can. They got big eyes and no wallet, you know. She's not a, if she's a, the complete opposite, if she's decisive and no, look, okay, I'm going to get this, 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 you know. I'm going to keep this stuff to a minimum because I don't know this guy like this and I'm not going to just, just be having him just spending excess because... You know, I think a date is supposed to be where I just get over. She has manners. She, she, she's considerate. You know what I'm saying? Like the old trick of, you know, if you open a door for her, open a door for her, and then she doesn't reach over to unlock the door for you. You know, that trick, like, she ain't a keeper if she don't do that, you know? If... If she takes an, inter, an interest in the things you're interested in, then she's a keeper because she's trying to like you and the things that make you you. So that's a sign that she's a keeper. Um, say, I like seafood. So if the woman I'm dating starts cooking Louisiana food like I cook it because it's not her thing you know then I know she's trying to she's trying to make herself um, a, a staple in my life you know she's trying to actually be here because she's like you know I'm gonna do the things that you like because I know you like them and this is what makes you happy you know she's she actually is trying to facilitate what makes you happy during the day and night you know um, I've said this before signs that she's a keeper is that she won't advertise what I mean by that is she look good but she won't take that extra step to try to look extra to the point where she looks like she's advertising for other people you know uh, and you know, the, you know the difference if you're paying attention like a woman wants to look attractive when she goes out with her man but some women want to be so quote unquote stunning that they want everybody looking at them and that kind of looks to the fact that she really wants the attention of other men you know when you don't want the attention of other men you wear the type of stuff your man likes and you kind of you know like that if he got taste if you don't got taste you just got kind of do you you know I'm one of those guys who I show a girl what I what I like and I you know and a lot of times they dig my style or my style or women's taste uh, or what they what I think they should wear or whatever. Another sign that she's a keeper is she respects your property. You know, she respects your personal space. She respects your privacy. She respects your property because. She doesn't need to be all in your grill 24-7. She's your, she's your woman. She ain't your mother, you know. So she's not going to be constantly asking you to look in your phone. And she's not going to be breaking your stuff or throwing, you know, even when she gets angry, she can talk it out. She's not going to throw something. And it's like, okay, she's not the type of woman to, you know, 
uh, destroy a property or bleach clothes or that type of cut up stuff because, you know, she respects the, the fact that if you did the same to her, that would be, that would be unacceptable, you know. A sign that she's a keeper is that she's intelligent, you know. It's better to have a smart woman than a sexy woman. Because smart women bring things to the table that sexy women can't. Sexy women can get you, uh, get, give you an erection, and a smart, but a smart woman can get you an investment. You know, that's 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 a big difference. Like that's something that you want to keep around you. You know, you try to mix the two to have somebody who's smart and sexy, but you have to actually have conversations with them and listen to them to see where their minds at. Um, signs that she's a keeper nowadays is she's able to be vulnerable with you. Because women nowadays try to act like guys, which is so stupid, as if they they have, you know, like they were socialized to be men when they weren't. But when she's willing to be vulnerable with you, she's willing to share her femininity with you. She wants you to be uh, she, you, she wants to put that on you. If you have kids, she's gonna be good to your kids and respectful to your kid's mother. You know, that's a sign of a keeper also, you know. Um, if she has kids, if she, if she's, if she takes care of her kids first and her responsibilities first and then and she handles those situations properly and then talks to you, she's a keeper because she's not looking for you to come save her from her decisions and her situations with her of having kids with, or whatever happened with her ex. She, she actually can handle her home situation without needing you to be a father figure. You know, she may have a, the, the father of that child might be just fine, you know. Um, Another sign that she's a keeper is she's honest, you know. And if she's willing to tell you what's popping and how she feels and she can uh, and also receive honesty, because sometimes you have to tell some people some real stuff that they may or may not like to hear. But if they can understand it and deal with it, it's dope, you know. The more I'm talking, I swear I made this video already. I'm going to just stop here and, see, and upload the video and see it. I think I got this video out there already. We'll see, though. Peace.